The word for today, care for the needy. Three quarters of the world's income ends up in the pockets of 20% of its population. Think of it this way. 10 dairy farmers live in the same valley and among them they own 10 cows. But the cows aren't evenly distributed one cow to one farmer. It's more like this. Two farmers own eight cows, while the other eight farmers share two cows. Does that seem right? What responsibility does God place on the haves with regards to the have-nots? First, that you allow yourself to feel concern and compassion. Second, that you get out of your comfort zone and do something about it. Blessed are those who have regard for the weak. The Lord delivers them in times of trouble. The Lord protects and preserves them. They are blessed in the land. He does not give them over to the desire of their foes. The Lord sustains them on their sickbed and restores them. Psalm 41, 1 to 3. When you bless the poor, God blesses you. So, as one leader wrote, make this your prayer. Lord, you promised we would always have the poor among us. Help me to make sure that the reverse is also true, that I am always among the poor, helping, encouraging, and lending a hand wherever I can. Enable me to love the invisible God by serving the very visible poor in my corner of the world. Help me to be creative without being condescending, encouraging without being egotistic, and fearless without being foolish. May the poor bless you because of me. Amen. That's the word for today.